Well, it's been just over a year since a tornado swept through South Abilene. There were no deaths or major injuries, but hundreds of homes and businesses were significantly damaged. Repairs still continue for many residents, and KRBC's Kevin Clack shows us the progress on a tiny home for one of those residents. We've been out here pretty much every day except Sundays. Priced at around $50,000 for everything. Keith Thomas, providing disaster relief with boots on the ground, said it's hard to put a value on providing someone a place to live. This tiny home is being built after a part of Abilene was devastated by a tornado a year ago in May. Uh, there was, of course, a lot of damage, uh, fences, roofs. Dr. Kathy Ashby, president of United Way of Abilene, says immediately they jumped into action. Our plan was to help our community as quickly as we could with rebuilding and repairing and restoring uh, their homes. One house in particular had severe roof damage and needed to be torn down and rebuilt. De demolished the house, cleaned the lot up. After four months of working, they're coming up on the end result and can't wait to see the look on its new owner's face. The, the fulfillment is in watching his face and his reaction once he you know, actually sees the place. In Abilene, Kevin Clack, KRBC, Abilene's local news. All right, thank you. Kevin Keith says after some final minor touches, they'll hand over the keys in the next couple of weeks.